Welcome back to the next part of Oblivion. Last time we were doing stuff, we killed all the Dark Brotherhood. They got what they deserve. We're now joining Lucien Lachance on his little uh, treasure hunt for more victims. So we have to travel to a cave to kill this necromancer. Um, which cave is it? One I haven't been to yet. Interesting. Shadowmare, or don't need you. Where are you going, Shadowmare? Have you not... I don't know where he's going. He might be traveling all the way back to uh, where he came from. I usually don't use the horses anymore anyways, so it's okay. Because I need athletics and acrobatics. How am I going to do that if I'm always on a horse? Nern route! We have to be getting close to the Nern route number. I think it was 30. Is that the most you need to get? If there's more, I have no idea where to look. Hello? Oh. Thought I heard battle music. Hello, who's that? The rock. Turn route. Yeah, it's definitely <laughs> good to keep an eye out. It's not doing the chime, though. I don't know why. Alright, sneaky, sneaky. Find out if he has a weakness. We didn't sneak very well, did we? Whoa! I feel like I've done this quest and I always just murdered him and never found out the secret weakness he had. Which is kind of funny. I'm taking these books because I might want to read them later. Hmm. Ebony arrows? The path of transcendence. Entry 1. My initial findings may have been inconclusive, but they set me on the path I will pursue until I achieve my goal or lie rotting in this cave. Either outcome will be a welcome respite from the days and nights I've spent tailing toiling without food water or any kind of companionship a lesser mage would have fallen prey to madness by now i'm sure of it but i am not a lesser mage though they try to earnest try in earnest though their hearts and minds are true to the teachings of our great uh, sovereign my fellow necromancers lack the complete dedication required to achieve the ultimate of goals the state of lichdom not even Falcar himself can match my sheer tenacity, my willingness to accept failure at, on any level. That is why I, Celadian, will soon join the ranks of the Worm Eremites? Er Eremites? Those servants favored by our sovereign above all others. I will sit with honor and obedience at his right hand while those fools in the Mage's Guild grovel at my maggot-ridden feet. Yeah, that sounds good. That maggots in your toes. Entry 2. Even the most ped pedestrian peasant fairy tale has long held the lich. Held that a lich must somehow remain bound to his soul. That connection must commonly manifest itself as a transference of the spirit into an actual physical object, an urn, a sarcophagus, a crystal file. One Khajiit fairy tale even tells of a lich who preserved his spirit in the severed head of a wood elf infant. And these same peasants long comforted, them, comforted themselves with the belief that if they ever had the grave misfortune of facing a lich, they would need only find the vessel containing his spirit from and then destroy it, thus destroying the lich himself. Fools in their folklore. True liches possess no such weaknesses. Can one of the sovereign's worm emerites be bested by shattering a glass vase? The very notion is so absurd as to be com comical. Yes, a necromancer must transfer his soul into a physical vessel, but once that transference is complete, once the necromancer has fully metamorphosed into his lich form, the vessel is inconsequential. But it's the process of this transference itself that has eluded me for so long. My soul remains bound to me, er, my earthly body, and nothing I have attempted has allowed me to free myself of this uh, mortal coil. 
and transcend to the state of lichdom. I so dearly desire. Entry 3. Every, to uh, every tome I've acquired the volumes upon volumes of necromatic discourse, all useless. I have grown disgusted by the years of wasted life that have been uh, poured into this so-called essential writings. Who in their right mind would wish, uh, ever wish to animate a month-dead cyrodelic butterfly or bring life to the rotting husk of a rare albino mud crab? How many months have I wasted away in this cave? And for the... what reason? Ah, yes, I know. I will resurrect an army of deformed goblin younglings and march on the white gold tower itself. That, at least, is in my reach. My mind has become a cesspool of necromatic waste where reject spells and rituals compete for the honor of finally deriving me completely insane. And I still... And still, I am no closer to achieving my goal than I was when I first began this process. Am I losing faith in myself and my discipline? Perhaps I have been studying too hard. Many a night I have sacrificed my prayers to our so uh, sovereign for one more experiment, one more incantation. What I need now is rest, rest in a state of tranquility so that I may commune with our sovereign and re-pledge my loyalty and devotion for what... Answer will I find in some crumbling codex that could not be supplied by our great sovereign himself. Oh my goodness, man. This guy likes to write. Entry 4. The secret is mine. So long I searched, so hard I toiled, but I was a fool. I was right to forego my studies for a more ardent devotion to prayer. Last night, as I sat in the throes... Of meditation our great sovereign did come to me he passed to me the knowledge i have sought for so long the secrets of transcendence were even more complex and arcane than even i could have imagined and i will never tra uh, transcribe them into my written work indeed they have been recorded all my months of solitude were for naught as the secret i so desperately sought could only be obtained through direct communication with out great uh, with our Without great sovereign himself, I will walk to the earth as a worm eremite, serving the sovereign in a state of endless undeath. Though the sacrifice of many innocents, this resurrection of many servants to aid me in my task, in the tireless performance of a nearly week-long ritual, I have completed construction of the sands of resolve, the transcendence to full lichdom will not be immediate, however. The vessel has been crafted, but many ener uh, energy forced. My soul must be fully transferred into it. Not even our sovereign was quite certain how long this process would take, and it varies from one necromancer to the next, based on many factors, both physical and spiritual. One thing, however, is certain. This hourglass must never leave my possession until the transference is complete. I grow more powerful every day, but in truth, am more vulnerable than I've ever been. If something were to happen to the Sands of Resolve, if the Hourglass should somehow leave my person, the connection between soul and vessel would be severed. To think that my work, my, my life, could be eradicated so easily after I've come so close to success is almost more than I can bear. Well, got a pickpocket and Hourglass. I could remove the Sands of Resolve from Slodigan's position, perhaps through pickpocketing. He would surely die. Well, let's see if we can get pickpocketing then. Kind of funny, he's like, I shouldn't record anything that the guy told me, but I will put my weakness down below. And leave the freaking <laughs> book out front. See if I can sneak around all the monsters, too. Sneaky, sneaky. Be fair, we already failed that because of the, uh... Ooh. Ooh. Huh? Where did you go? Come out when I can see you! Fuck, you caught me. No, I want to pickpocket him.
Ah! <laughs> I like how he dies instantly. So then he is dead. I must pick up my reward and next contract at the dead drop located in an old sack hidden in the bushes beneath the great oak in the city of Coral. That's funny. Oh, I failed it the first time, though. I'm a cheater. Oh well. It was still funny. I'm a big old cheater. I did the save scum technique. Alright, how do I get out of here? Am I stuck down here in the cave with him forever? Ah. Oh, we're good. Try, there's still. Undead. Excuse me, sir. Didn't see nothing. Didn't see nothing. Got away. Oh, not really. Still coming after me. Hopefully, you don't chase me forever. Who are you? Gosh darn scamp hiding in the bushes. He's in the bushes. Did the wraith come out of the cave? Because I'll just kill the wraith. Oh! Oh no, they're gone. Okay. Whoops. Whoops. All the wrong buttons. All the wrong ones. I'm back in coral, baby. How are we doing today, friends? What you got for me? Dead drop number two. I picked up my reward and received my next contract. I'm not going to read this because I want to read the actual document. We'll get the information. The document. Necromancer Seldian is dead and you are not. That is quite an accomplishment, but your work as a silencer ju has just begun. Your next assignment requires you to eliminate not just one target, but five. An entire family, in fact. The unlucky siblings are Perennia Draconis, Matthias Draconis, Andreas Draconis, Sibylia Draconis, and Celia Dacronis. Draconis. Lo locations of most of the family are unknown. So you should begin your search with the family matron, Perenia, who resides at the farm called Apple Watch. You must discern the location of all the Draconius family members and then systematically eliminate them. I suggest you first speak with the mother and find out if she has any valuable information on the whereabouts of her children before ending her life. When every member of the Draconis family lies dead, journey to the city of Skingrad in the castle courtyard. You will find a well containing your reward for the Draconis contract, as well as any further assignment I might have. Okay, time to kill a whole family. At least they get to join each other with Sithis. Gotta get into the roleplay. Oh! Where is it? Oh god, it's an ogre! Get him, Shadow Mare! Oh, there's also a bear. Oh god. Not the button I meant to hit. Get him, Pringle! Hey, what? Why is my horse tagging it? What are you two doing? I don't think Shadow Mare is like... What? Why'd you attack? Maybe he hit him on accident, I don't know. Whatever. You two need to get along! Why are you living out here by yourself? Hello. Oh. Hello there. I'm sorry, you startled me. My nerves get rattled rather easily these days, I'm afraid. Living alone will do that to you. Now, is there something I can help you with? Yes, ma'am. Looking for your children. My children? Whatever for? Oh, oh dear. Excuse an old woman's stupidity. You're here to pick up my gift list. Of course. Using your gift service was the smartest thing I've ever done. 
my children are spread across Cyrodiil, and it's so hard to shop for them all. So here's the list of all my precious little ones, though I dare say they're not so little anymore. <laughs> they grow up so fast, I swear. You'll notice that the list gives each child's location and some suggestions for gifts. Oh, and here's the gold I'm supposed to give you. Now please go. Those children are so dear to me, and I'd really like you to get them something special. Thanks again. What an unfortunate circumstance. Dear Courier, I would like to thank you again for agreeing to assist me. I was so delighted when I friend recommended you and you will certainly employ your services again in the future if everything goes well. With this round of purchases, you can imagine how difficult it is for an old woman such as myself to get around my children. Darlings that they are deserve the best, and I am afraid I haven't been able to properly show my love and appreciation for them in quite a few years, but all that is behind me now. Here's the list of gifts I will... Uh, here's the list of gifts I think my family would most enjoy as well as each children's current place of residence, which should be used to afford delivery. Mathis, Telus Plus District, Imperial City, has a home there. Mathis always likes... Don't care about that, we know where he is. Andreas the Drunken Dragon Inn. The Bilia Muck Valley Cavern. Yes, my daughter lives in a cave, and no, I'm not very happy about it. <laughs> Celia, Castle Laywin, you'll find her in the barracks. So she's a guard. Already received half your fee in advance, and will receive the remainder after the gifts have been purchased and delivered. As we originally agreed, thank you again for providing such a valuable service. Sincerely, Perenia Draconis. It's just a very unfortunate thing of... My cat just knocked down all my shit. Okay. So... Can I get a poisoned apple into your pocket? That'd be fine. And while I'm off doing other things, uh... This can just work its way. Okay. Let's see. Here you are. No. Oh, you only can place items in zero weight. Interesting. I wonder if that changes if you become like a master. I'm going to steal all your food. Hey, doggy. It's like I grow my own food, but it's all gone and I have this apple. Oh, well. Gosh, that's a well trained dog not eating all your potatoes being right there. That's a bowl. I didn't need that. Oh, I don't need all that either. Here, you can have that shit back. That was a mistake picking it up in the first place. You'll even get extra junk. There you go. I doubt she'll just eat grain, but you never know. Some people are weird. Let that deal with itself. We'll head to the city of Talos Plaza. I'll place an apple in that person's pocket too, and then head off to a next target. Have pity, sir. I got nothing to eat. They can see me, but can I place while well, they see me? Does it dictate? Find out, won't we? All right, good luck, sir. Next, let's see. Drunken dragon in. Just slip an apple in. So here you go. My sister sneezed. Bless her. A 
Oh, by the nine divines. Why do I get all the riffraff? It might be hard for him to die from the apple because he has food everywhere. We'll see. Just sneaking around putting apples in people's pockets. Call me the witch from Sleeping Beauty. Yeah, can't remember if that's that uh, story or not. Well, at least they're slow, not too bright. Stop right there! Hmm. Might be because I could be seen. So long. Take care. Reaper. Hail! Well met. What have you been up to? Oh my god. I understand Daedra worship has become increasingly prevalent in the Somerset Isle. It seems Somerset Damn. Isle has become a much more dangerous Spread place. out! It's like midnight. I need a place of an apple Dead. in her pocket. You too. Hail. Read any good books lately? I've been reading Fundaments of Alchemy. I figure it can't hurt to learn something new. I've not read that yet. It's a shame there isn't more time to spend with good books. Take care. Stop right there! Oh Kevin my god. I didn't even take anything. I just looked. So long. Take care. Yeah, you know what? My pleasure, really. Did she take it? Yep, I think so. Alright, next target. Yeah, there's one living out in a cave. That one? Yeah. We. Ah! Yeah, it didn't hurt that bad. Don't overreact. Oh my! Why did it crash? Oh. Good day, but. Well. Guess giving everybody apples uh breaks the game. Get back to it, shall we? I heard that some of the provinces were talking. Okay, so. King about secede. Fast travel away. <laughs> Could be that I was giving them poison apples. They're dying while I'm not there. Cause the game to crash. I'm... You just gotta think of things, you know? Yeah, maybe. Ah! Ah! At least it launches up very quickly. One of the better things about some of those old video games. Get right back into them right after the crash. Oh, look! The Daedric Shrine! Mm, who's this? Is it Periate? I have no idea. Ooh! That was a far drop. Ooh! We're being risky here, boys. Oh my goodness. Vermina. Oh! Hello? I have mastered my fears. There is no terror to compare with what Vermina has shown me in my dreams. How do I talk to Vermina? Oh, you're not the priest. Who are you? Who dares to walk in the House of Shadow? What business do you have with the Lord Vermina? I want to talk to her. Here we worship Vermina, praying for her to grant us true visions. What is your business here? I wish to speak with Vermina. To speak with Vermina, you must offer a black soul gem to the Deidre Lord. Damn. Okay. We walk. Uh, I want to enchant my new sword. I forgot about that, but it's true. Do I have more than one black soul gem? Maybe these empty. 
Well, I have. Okay, I have green. Yeah, just Watch give her the black one. Yep. We meet again, mortal. We met before? Or we have met before, whether you know it or not. Oh, okay. Reaper. When you mutter in your sleep, you speak to me. When you wake and wet with sweat, you've just left my house. That doesn't sound too comforting, I'll be honest. I dwell in your dreams. I savor your nightmares. Now you will serve me. Okay, what do you want? The wizard Arkfeld has the orb of Vermina. Snatched from the dreams of my followers and dragged into the waking world. Travel to his tower and retrieve my orb. Take care, though, mortal. In my orb, Arkhmed has found more than he bargained for. After I left an offering of a black soul gem, Vermina's follower summoned the Daedra who spoke to me. Vermina told me of an orb that had been stolen by the wizard Arkvard. I am to travel to his tower, retrieve the orb, and bring it back to Vermina. Yeah, we're doing this quest. I don't remember this quest. Could be one of those towers that I was never allowed into. Apparently it's right nearby. Look at that, we found another Daedra quest. That's always fun, I wonder if we'll get anything cool. Give me something cool. Convenient that the guy who stole your shit is right next door. It's actually a cave I haven't discovered. What do you got going on in here, huh? What you got going on in here, huh? There's also an alien rune behind it. We might go in there, too. Arkvards, Arkbeard. Manda, manda, man. Sneaky time. Sneaky, sneaky. The doors are so slow. Oh! Oh! Release a remastered version, please. I feel like that's what Bethesda's plan is while they wait for Elder Scrolls. Six, they're gonna release a better optimized version of the older games. Why do you have a guide to all the towns, you weirdo? Look at this. Five, one, two, four. Sir, can you count? Maybe he's reading them in random order just to spice it up a little. So, uh, Vermina didn't say I had to kill the man, but maybe I can steal the orb while sneaking. Oh! Oh, I gotta squeeze! Oh! Oh, yeah, wonderful. Open, please! Stealing, huh? Well, I'll steal all your shit. I don't care. Oh my gosh, bro. Seriously? What the? Oh. Um. Okay. Something's out there. Didn't realize that we were on the roof. Oh gosh, it's a nice astronaut. Planes of Oblivion inside your castle here, huh? Alright, sir. Sound like a dinosaur when I killed him. Ooh. Well, that's, uh... Yeah, you definitely did something to him. This is why you don't mess with Daedrus. There's two ways to go, though. What if, what if there's a treasure chest or something up top? Look, I was right. I don't remember this quest. I don't know if I've ever done this one. 
There's no achievement for all the Daedric Shrines, so I might not have ever done this. Huh. It's so spoopy. So spoopy. I'm drenched in sweat. And a free claw. Almost over encumbered. I bet it's all my ingredients and stuff again. I do that a lot. Oh, that sword is also 50 pounds, though. The one I have to enchant. Seriously? Oh, yeah. It crashed. At least I remembered it this time. Hello? It's clan first. This is a cool looking room. That's where you guys got some of the ideas for Shadow Goras room. I don't really want to mess with these guys too much because they are strong. I mean, Stunlock me oh. Oblivion. Oh. oh. Did not mean a quick save there, but Pringle can take care of this. Ah, uh, he's blocking the way. <gasps> Real! Real! Save me! Oh, oh god, Pringle! Whew. Jeez, I'm... That was close. Told you those things were dangerous. I feel like my healing isn't doing as much as it should. I had enough time to run upstairs and open the other door for this door to still not be open. I like how the Clanifers were a bigger problem than you were. Okay, so that's the door you can actually go through. It's up here. Oh my lord. Why is it so bloody? Did you eat him? Get reflected back at him. Get wrecked, bitch. Oh, look at this. Everything's so big. Except for the room. Ah! Oh, shoot. Oh, oh shoot. Whoa. Sunlock to death. That's how it goes. You go, you either two tap him or you get stunlocked to death. One or the other. Pringle, body wall. Oh! No, wait, it hit me through Pringle. I'm just gonna stand back here and heal and watch. Nice, good job, Pringle. You're the best. Why is all the food utensils not big, too? You're gonna make the everything else big, make the utensils big, you know? That'd be a very comfy bed. Deeper in we go. Lucian's like, why did the silencer just stop working? I'm busy. I'm busy. Oh. I think the thing spawn came. Yeah. Okay, we're good. Whew. 
Those little ones bite you, they paralyze you. Oops. Bound mace, that's what I'm talking about. Leave me alone! Thank you for recharging my mana. Oh my goodness. Oof. This looks friendly. Oh, something leveled up. Blade. Okay, it's been a long time since Blade leveled up. Is that a porthole? Trap door to Arkvard's retreat. Oh. Sir, are we in amnesia? That's what this is giving me. Amnesia vibes. I don't understand you. I got amnesia. This is like a maze or something. I'm gonna go here again. Am I playing Visceral Cleanup Detail? Am I playing the game I meant to say, Lethal Company? But if you want a chillax game and you like tedious work, Visceral Cleanup is where it's at, bro. Don't you bite me. Get out of here. Something else angry at me, too. Oh. Oh, hi. Did I hit you with that? Maybe. Oh! Almost died. Thank goodness. Why did you guys have to put so many wooden doors in here? Is that really necessary? This where he is? Oh, it sounds creepy in here. It's got like an eerie whine. Oh. Jeez. He's definitely trained up his danger skills. My goodness. Oh. Whoa! Oh, fuck. See, that's what gets you. Ah! Luckily, I just quick saved. Well, you summon your spiderling, that makes my life easier. So, you just gotta get him in the right combination and you'll be fine. Death sound, you can stop. I died once, alright? Jeez, I'm gonna have to rub it in. New grand soul jam. Nice. Probably gonna get filled, like, instantly. I think we have, like, Expert, right? We don't need Journeyman. Yeah, we have Master. We need a Master Ambelic, though. Ooh. Okay, well, you can have that. It said Shock Damage Resisted. It's like, bro, I reflected it at him. It wasn't in my control. Oh my goodness. I'll, I'll say I'll take out the Clan for first. You're good to me. I don't think you can beat him 1v2. Yeah. It's alright, it's 2v2 now, see? Your buddy was just, uh, taking a nap. I mean, if you want to let the frost guy through, I'm fine with that. Pringle, don't walk into it. I feel like Pringle's probably mad at me because of the fact that I hit him with that spell. It don't matter, you dead. Your AI broken there, bud? You stopped attacking.
Oh, Jesus. At least that wasn't some weird command. That have been awkward. Oh, look, a bunch of dead people. I wish I could actually use the ingredients, but it will increase my freaking intelligence, which I don't need. Ugh. Oh, you over-encumbered me? I don't have ale. Where all this? Did I steal this or something? Yeah, I had a lot, too. I must have stole it. I don't remember stealing that shit. Can I find you yet? Alright, that's opening right now, so... Is that him? Yeah, I think that's him. I don't think I was supposed to leave. Oh, is it this? Oh, I looked right at it. A note written in the trembling hand. There is no world so great as the world of the mind. There is no voyager so well tra traveled as the traveler in the land of dreams. There is no abyss so deep, the well of terror that lies within each of us. A plummet plumbed its depths. I have seen the unthinkable. I am unafraid. Even death's boundaries do not confine me. I am the lord of limitless space and the master of the place and time. Through the doors of sleep the universe is waiting for me. I will no longer wait for my dreams to carry my worlds away to unknowable deeps so unspeakable vastness. I shall dwell in the house of Ermina forever, the orb my companion. There is no compass of my destination, no end to my journey. My mind is the eternal voyager, fearless and wild with wonder in the halls of horror. I retrieved the orb of Vermina. I should now return to its shrine. Yeah, I don't even need to kill the guy. He was tired. Take a nap. Let me discover this place. Then we'll head back to Vermina and we'll fast travel back to this tomb. Because I need to explore it because I haven't found this one yet. I haven't found it yet. Alright. Let's head back to Bermina. Bermina, I got your orb! Did you kill the guy? No. Oh. Well, I wanted you to. Oh well. My orb is returned. And Arkfed will live out the rest of his days in nightmare. It is fitting. Oh, so I, he's left there now. <laughs> you have proved yourself. Mortal. It is fitting as well that you should bear my token. I don't even know what you give me. Uh, Vermina, Skull of Corruption. Vermina was pleased that I returned the orb of Vermina. I have been rewarded with the Skull of Corruption. Oh, is that all it is? Was this originally in this game? Oh, wow. Corruption for 30 seconds on target. What does that mean? What is corruption? Well, I'm gonna try it. I doubt it's very good. Alright. What is corruption? Get back to that quest we were working on. Huh. That's the cave right here. I wonder if any of those targets died yet. One, two, three, four, five. I don't think they're going to eat the apples, because we were gone for a while. So I'm just going to kill them. Kill them myself. Take the apples back. Another Nurn root. How close are we to the uh, number of Nurn root we need? We need 30. Oh yeah, I'm getting over encumbered from ingredients, I bet you. 19. Still need a lot. Alright, corruption. Did it hit you? What does corruption do? Take this one out for a run. Oh, 
That's a bear. There you go. There's a bear. Kick his ass, Pringle. Oh, whoops, I summoned Pringle again. That was not what I meant to do. There you go, Mr. Bear. There, Mr. Bear. Another bear. Whoa! Oh! Oh, jeez, Scoob. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Yes. Fight. Fight amongst yourselves. Oh. I didn't know I quick saved here. I'm glad I did. Oh. You two need to settle your differences. Leave me out of this. Jeez, I'm I think I ran backwards. Hard to tell after you get turned around being dead and all. Where are you? You there! You there! Stop where you are! Why won't you die? Oh god, that's a fucking mountain man. Still a mountain lion. Pringle! Okay. Good job. One target down. Six more? I don't. But I'm going to end this part off here, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, please let me know by leaving a like, comment what you thought below, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Later, everybody.